They say a prisoner once smeared salsa from his meal onto the prison bars and, after two years, managed to corrode them enough to get out. To test the rumor, the team built a mock prison wall and made window bars from five different metals, including stainless steel and pure iron. They bought several store-bought salsas and discovered that jarred salsa was the mildest in heat but had the highest acidity. So they mixed an acidic solution to match that acidity and soaked some bars in it, while soaking others directly in the jarred salsa. Because they couldn't wait two years, they looked for a way to speed up the process. Saline solutions act as electrolytes, and salsa contains a lot of salt so they tried passing electric current through the salsa to accelerate corrosion. Adam wrapped bars with towels soaked in salsa and attached wires. When a wire contacted the salsa, a strong current flowed and a lot of white smoke rose. Jimmy took a different approach, using a radio's DC transformer to route electrons from the negative lead through the salsa back to the positive lead, effectively producing an alternating effect and bubbles began forming in the salsa, showing the method was working. After five days, Jimmy's bars showed clear corrosion, while Adam's showed no change. One month later, Jimmy's bars were more than half corroded. At that rate, his method would allow an escape in about three months. The bars that had been soaked in the acidic solution and in salsa both corroded to varying degrees, but surprisingly the salsa outperformed the chemical acid. Based on the observed corrosion rate, a prisoner who could keep this up for 50 years could, in theory, escape using this method. 